Alrighty, hey all, and welcome to the final game of, I want to say day five of the Hellfirecom Super Nintendo Fun. Man, they're uh, just steadily running out now. We're going to be playing some Learn with Pokemon Typing Adventure to close out the Pokemon block. Show of hands, who's actually seen this? Who's actually played this? I, would be I have my own copy of it here, but I haven't beat it before, so this could be interesting. I'd be surprised if it's uh, more than 50% of you honest, but anyway, Space. let's get on with it. <sighs> I only have to touch the uh, thing once here, thankfully. So let's go to a new game and start shit. What we're basically doing is we're learning to type and whatnot. And I wouldn't expect any advanced typing things. I'm very much... Um, like using my index fingers for this particular game because the keyboard itself isn't that big. I have small hands and even for me I'm like struggling to get the speed down pat. On my regular one I can type fast as anything. I'm pretty sure the rest of the HFC Discord can uh, you know back that up. But on this it's a little bit harder so don't be expecting any Kino like typing combos. I'll do my best. Yeah, like, I'm just looking at my one right now, and it's like half the length of my actual keyboard. It's like, I know it's made for little kids, so it kind of makes sense, you know. It'd probably be easier for little kids to, like, move around quickly on, but for us, for us man children, we don't kind of have that luxury. <laughs> Alright, so uh, I guess while I go ahead and get started here, why don't you explain who we are and what we're doing, Mo? I can indeed do that. Ladies and gentlemen, we are Hellfire Comms and we are running the Hellfire Comms Super Nintendo Thon. This marathon is going on it. We're on day five, as Tom mentioned, and we are raising money for the charity Child's Play. And what Child's Play do is they provide toys and games to children who are stuck in hospital just to make their, their stay a little bit easier, a little bit more manageable, you know. If they're not feeling well and they're in the hospital and separated from their family, then having some new games to play really will just raise their mood a bit, make them feel a bit better. So it's absolutely a worthy cause. You can donate to the charity by clicking the donate button just below the stream, or if I just post this little donate prompt in chat, you can also go to that tilt fire link there. <laughs> Uh, what did you do? No, I just, I got completely frazzled on the first thing and I like missed multiple times, but I still got silver overall, so... <laughs> That's fine. I think it does get a little bit harsher. Like, I seem to recall my choke point wasn't any of the actual levels, but when Ho-Ho comes up, just because he starts firing stuff at you and it's really quickly, but out of, like, otherwise, just typing in the Pokemon as they appear and the little single letter prompts they're giving you in this tutorial. It, it's not too bad, thankfully. Hmm. Alright, press the home key. My room. It's all one big menu, really. <laughs> That's what a room is, right? Mm-hmm. Typist so. card. Let's have a look here. Accuracy, 84%. Uh-huh, uh-huh, sure. Let's try and lift that up a bit. You're so, so typist. I know. <laughs> I want to be a ho-o typist. Maybe later. Currently, we are actually at $4,399.99. So if someone wants to lift that up a bit and maybe round it out, that would be nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know you want to. It's all for a good cause. Mm -hmm. All right, we need 15 medals, so... We have our first goal in mind. Let's go to the X Resort. Didn't realise kids were allowed in there, but hey, the more you know. <laughs> oh god. Protector remains us. Why is this a thing? It's just like a little entertainment game for kids, really. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's an educational tool. I like edutainment, so let's go. just realised I've put out my tweet on the HFC Twitter, the HFC Marathon's Twitter, but I've done it on my own, so let's try and do that too. <laughs> Why not, mate? Why not? I'm not quite as adept at shilling, but I did manage to get a pun in the post I put out, so that's good enough for me. Yeah, that's right, just one donation will get us over 4.4k. Yeah, I got all three medals then. 
Oh, well done. I can type, guys. I can really <laughs> type. <laughs> you got this. <laughs> nah, I would assume there's a mission for like every key on the keyboard, which means there's a lot of missions. The ETA is like an hour, maybe 90 minutes max. We'll see how the later missions do, mate. Well yeah, I did like just skim some Let's Plays that I saw on YouTube. Some of them are a little bit longer, but I didn't actually watch through, so I don't know whether that's bonus content or not. I haven't actually played past like a few missions from now, so... Same, but you know. <laughs> right, we got the D, we got the C, we got the space. I wonder if there's figures out there for our world that's actually sold. I doubt it. I would be interested to know, actually. Yeah, because as Protector Remains mentioned, it, like, the 3DS and whatnot was already out by then. Yeah, it came out in 2011 in Japan, 2012 over it. Uh, I don't know about figures. Oh, in Japan, Pokemon Type and DS topped the sales chart in the first week, selling 59,000 copies. That doesn't sound like that much, but... Oh, it's still on the top 10 charts for the week of June 13th through 19th, and will go on to sell a total of 201,723 copies by the end of 2011, being the 56th most bought title that year. So, in terms of reception, the aggregate score on game rankings is 69%. Nice. It's got 32 from Famitsu, 4.2 from Games TM, and I think that's the official Nintendo Magazine gave it an 84, so positive on the whole. Mm. I got messed up thanks to Azuril. I thought it was Barrel because I'm constantly having to look down at the thing. Yeah, that is one of them things. And, oh, that's the thing I get with Wii U games sometimes when they use the gamepad. It's like, am I looking up at the screen or am I looking down at the thing? Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, got to juggle both. Yeah, that's cool. Got a couple of medals instead of just one, so... Yeah. As far as I understand, this game's pretty decent with letting you continue and progress with the story, even if you don't do overly well in the mission. So hopefully we shouldn't have any, like, hold up. <laughs> yeah, no worries, mate. Right, let's go to the Z Islands and meet the professor for this game. The what islands? The Z Islands. Don't you mean the Z Islands? No, I don't. <laughs> well, fuck you. <laughs> All right, here we go. Quentin Wirty. Quirty for short. <laughs> I love that. No. Yeah. Yeah, it uh, ramped up in difficulty pretty quickly there, if you noticed. Like, Rocky Range, Beginner's Beach, Space. <laughs> yeah, I feel like we've skipped a few levels here. <laughs> Just a hunch. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder what Pokemon's gonna show up here. Ah, we got the typing balls now. Okay. Type the name of the Pokemon to use the balls. Paige is a bit of a shit. I don't know why she was criticising you for not being a, uh, a brilliant typist. Uh, we can only use certain keys on the keyboard so far, so maybe we're not the greatest. Maybe not. Alright, we'll give it a shot. The Z Islands, alright. Hey. Thankfully, since this is a... Uh, Early. We don't have to type the whole name. Yeah, you just start it up. I remember on the tutorials that threw me off a bit just because I instinctively went to finish it off and threw off me rhythm, but like that's just the thing of if you're if you know the Pokemon series as well as we do, the idea of learning a Pokemon's name is kind of a different thing, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, there's several of them. Nice. Yeah. Magneton! <laughs> Fuck off, Fro, you creepy bastard. Fro and Silk are weird designs. Like, I know they're kind of like the XBs for him on Chan and him on Lee, but I don't know. The originals did it better. There we go. Not bad. Nicely done. Not bad. Oh, I kind of missed out on the gold there. Yeah, well. Alas. As long as you still get some medals, you're doing alright. Mm -hmm. 
A couple of medals per mission should be uh, pretty copacetic. Mm -hmm. H peak. Can't wait to go there. I don't think I have actually been there. That sounds like an interesting name for something. Oh, Control is here. What's Control about? Is that like the options room? <laughs> no, it's the control room. That's brilliant. Switch keyboard skids or sounds here once you have them. Huh. You can alter the fingering guide, collect more medals to get the door. I'm not gonna giggle. It's okay, man. I swear I'm not gonna giggle. It's fine. It's fine. Alright, uh, so we're moving on to S now. This is a very end of day sort of game to play, I gotta be honest. <laughs> it really is, though. I know I'm half asleep, I don't know about you. <laughs> well, no, I haven't really done that much today. Uh, I was on for Dash with you, did a bit of Pokehead and Tournament DX with Tanner. Now I'm uh, just fine, really. Yeah, you just got to tie a bunch of Pokemon names in and kept a fairly simple task for the end. Hey. Alright. Oh, chip. Hey, you got day two, Laz. Dear Link. DE, you motherfucker. Axe you. Bless you. Thankfully, I can see the Pokemon coming before the actual thing pops up, so... Yeah, it gives you a bit of an advantage if you're familiar with the series, which maybe not like the most advantageous thing given it's an entertainment game, but still. Yeah. Oh, you're trying but, to throw me off with a, a different season of dealing, are you? How has it changed season so quickly? I don't know. Ah, Nuzleaf. What the Nuzlocke is named after. Uh, do you want to grab that one tweet I made and uh, explain to people what's going to be happening on my birthday this year? Uh, I can do, but I believe you mentioned that for the birthday stream this year, it's going to be a, another Child's Play fundraiser and it's going to be a Pokemon Nuzlocke stream. Mm -hmm. And let me just find your tweet. So I can actually link it rather than me try and faff around and recall it. <laughs> nice. Kakaka combo. Results. New ranking. Give me those medals, baby. Regular typist is me. Well done. Uh, just posted the link to the tweet in the chat. If you have any suggestions for games that you might like to be considered, then just reply to that tweet with them, because you're going to make a poll, aren't you, when you've mm -hmm. got a few ideas down? Yeah, after the uh, Super Nintendo fund is done, on my uh, week off, I'll just put together a nice cash poll, as it were. Yeah. Nice and cash. Nice and cash. This is a... Uh... Actually, something I showed on Twitter earlier while I was balancing my audio and whatnot. Before today's event started, it's the superior level. The level featuring superior, I mean. Yeah, like, I. Superior's design's okay. I but... didn't ask for your fucking live story, Flame. I was just talking about superior. I was talk. I was going to talk about superior! <laughs> Go ahead, mate. I was going to say that it's okay, but it's one of the weaker grass Pokemon designs, like grass starter designs. Mm -hmm. Honestly, it could only benefit from a Mega Evolution. <laughs> that goes for, I think, I would say, like, all of the universe starters, honestly. Oh, yeah. Like, turn Samurott to Water Fighting, turn Embor to Fire Dark, and, I don't know, another Grass Dragon for uh, Superior. Maybe, like, they did use that for Sceptile, though, so maybe something else would work a bit better. Maybe give it flying, given it sort of is airborne anyway. Mm hmm Ugh. This fucking thing. Hate it. What a got. Yeah, I hate it. 
an event. <laughs> Get tricky now. It's three words. But we are. Yeah. <laughs> Probably it says if Pokemon were real, then Fidoff would be the most common Pokemon around. Like, particularly around where I am, yes. Oh yeah, I'm using my fingers now. <laughs> You're doing it. Bring it on, bitch. I ain't scared of you. Oh, boss is here. Oh, well, you know who it is. You know what time it is, it's the music! Superior. Whoops, caught already. Sorry guys. <laughs> yeah, the music in this game is fantastic, so we're dead. I wonder what stopped me from getting silver though. Yeah. Probably speed. Might be, yeah. Alas, I got past it anyway, so... Yeah. To be fair, it's like the first proper boss. Mm -hmm. What research did we do exactly? We just caught a Pokemon. You learnt to type the first few letters of its name. Well, alright then. You're really approved. Oh boy, four letters coming up, guys. Oh yeah. Thankfully, I think I can type before it actually appears. Dino. Oh, so it let you get like a head start on it? Yeah. That's cool. Actually, use a full name, don't do that. <laughs> this is fun. I like that there's a big variety of different Pokemon showing up because for this kind of thing they very easily could have just gone with like a Gen 1 thing. Oh yeah. Balls. There goes my combo. Oh, no, mind, I kept it. Ha, oh, you. Like, I saw you stumble over that. <laughs> Stumbled over that one and all. Well, that's not explaining it, but they should have it. Just a Volcarona, it's right there. Research complete. Yeah, knowing Pokemon off we my heart is miracles. very handy going in. Okay, we have a donation of a dollar and ninety-seven cents from Soul Eater. There's no comment there, but that does push us over the four thousand four hundred, so thank you very much for that. Nice. Now you're ready to explore never-ending tab track, so off you go. I don't like the sound of that, I don't want to be here all night. <laughs> oh, it's never-ending. Like, you, you can just keep on playing the never-ending typing game while we do other stuff like in a picture-in-picture. -picture. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I'm just typing until the marathon's over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> never-ending. Can you name ten of these fuckers? <laughs> can you type out the whole pokey rap without looking? Oh, I have to type all of them. Yeah. You get a bit of a preview, but I feel like some of it's going to come down to memory. Okay, gotta do this again. Chicory is an easy one to type, though. Uh. Sharon. There's a lot of Solosis here. Sure are. I don't know what that one is. Oh, Cottony. Cotton E. Uh, C dot. The Gen 5 Pokemon is screwing me over because there's a lot of them that I just don't remember off the top of my head. Mm -hmm. Plus all. I know my boy, alright? Yes. 
Nice cinder crew. Really? No. Oh my god, it's never ending. Really? Oh yeah, it's Craggy. Really? Thank you. I pressed start and it just went over. But that's fine. <laughs> Results. New ranking. I got 23. That's good for me. I got a bronze. I'm now an advanced typist and I received the fire skin. Good research. Whew, that ranked up a little bit there. Yep. Uh, customers. Let's see what the fire skin looks like. Fuck yes, it's the fire stars. <laughs> oh, nice. Alright, what's next? F. Let's go to F. I'd rather not, if that's okay. Oh, you are literally at zero energy right now, Flame. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if this Lucas A does anything about it. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, aim for a thousand points. Alright. Thank you, and we've got the Kim Five Regents called because I didn't. Babasaur. Oh, it's Mighty Edda. Yeah. Balls. I'm typoing too much here. Doesn't want me to type anymore. Then uh, what's on screen? Oh! Diglett. I'm getting too enthusiastic. kind of came out of nowhere. <laughs> I'm getting too enthusiastic here. Just type exactly what it wants and nothing else. Yeah, no, when several of them appear, you just gotta wait for the thing to pop up. Oh, that's a hard one. Fuck. Mm. Not a fan of that. Uh, but I got it done, I guess. Oh, I'll try that again. Yeah, might as well. <clears throat> no, it's mainly Osha Water that seems like the stumping point. Mm -hmm. Oh, they rotate the Pokemon each time. I swear they weren't a Lilybot last time. Oh. It's Trilba. Skitty. Hey. Nice. Much better. Yeah. Uh, best doggo Pokemon. There's a lot I like, actually. Uh, I like Houndoom. In terms of like the more cutesy ones, I do like Yamper a lot. Mm -hmm. Fifty different Pokemon. Wow. You typed them on a screen. Uh, number one, very bizarre. All oh, right, now we're moving to the numbers. Yeah, now we're going on to actual places rather than tutorial places. Mm -hmm, well, bloody hell. I saw some big evolutions there as well. Berries will roll towards you here. Type what's on them quickly or they'll pass you by. I saw that ambi problem. you got to type his name with both hands. All right. Here we go. P. E. That's a little, so you got it. Yeah, we were just talking about you earlier, Sunkern. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't too positive, I hope you don't mind. Nope. It's not our fault, you suck balls. To be fair, it's not his I ever, he was programmed that way. <laughs> oh man, I have no idea what that is. 
That's a crooked top. There we go. What's all? I always, I always get crooked top and crooked tune confused. Crooked tune's the evolution. You gotta put the space in and the full stop for mine, Junior. You extra bastard. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So there's enough berries. Are you done with berries? Clearly not. Why well, I expect you to oh my god, giraffe rig. <laughs> Good luck, remember his name's full intro. I got it. Uh, Kuranai, the wolf Pokemon from Sun and Moon was Lycan Rock. Mm -hmm. Which is a pretty cool Pokemon, actually. Junior. Fuck off, Mom Junior. You're an abomination <laughs> of grammar. <Recess> <laughs> yeah, space bars and Recess periods. This level had everything involved. You know what I want to say, and I know I'm a broken record at this point, but. Full stop. I know. <laughs> What's the difference between a full stop and a period, then? Like, period is the Americanism. Oh. Sorry, mate. <laughs> I'm slowly reminding you what country you live in. Alright, there we go. It's a, it's a, it's a ghost! Ah, based Gengar. It's lit, fam. I don't know what this is. I'll go with it. Yeah, it's one with a sick as fuck evolution. There we go. I got the key. Nice. Oh, I gotta get the key. <laughs> this, is, this is the new Pokemon key. <laughs> and you come. I like, I like Gengar just popping up like that. Bitch. The Gengar episode in Journeys was actually pretty cool. Hmm. Like I've, I'm wanting to watch Journeys, but no one invites me to anything. I always have to make the arrangements myself. Well, usually when I sit down to watch stuff, it's my just crashing watch stuff rather than talking watch stuff. <laughs> Fair enough. Alright, now we're going to HP. Hang on. Do you have the Sorry. title of Advanced Typist? Ah, good, you have it. Now we can research HP. Nice one. Hmm. Is that a Mudsdale? No, it can't be. That's Gen 7. Yeah, it's a Gen 5 game. Can't get ahead of yourself. Nope. Alright. Tepig, you son of a bitch. Don't insult my bacon like that. Darmanitan, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I got two. Typing happy though, it doesn't want all of it all the time. No, just then it would make you creating you Mega Man boss, Charman. Yeah. Uh, oh. Daru Mac. Slugma. Slugma. I don't think Slugma moves like that. Oh, Flareon. Flareon. He of little moves. He of little moves. Imagine. Oh, <laughs> here it come. Oh my god, it's fucking Groudon. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Level 50, bitch. <laughs> Give me the opportunity to catch you, come on. Groudon. Got him! And just nice. a, a single Pokeball, too. Hell, well, you threw a load of letters at him. I suppose that counts as weak in him. Results, not bad. Bronze medal. 
Nice. They most asks with one of the chat points messages. Tom, do you want to do a community watch parties for Journeys one week so you can have people to watch with? Oh, that might be fun. I'm not really bothered to go about getting super high scores, Eve. Nah, that's fair enough. You've just got to get enough medals to go to the next place, really, ain't you? Mm -hmm. Very unrealistic game. One Pokeball to catch a Groudon. Well, I mean, there's always that, like, 0.001% chance, isn't there? Mm -hmm. like, when I was playing Platinum, I did get lucky with a quick ball on Dialga. Hmm. I have noticed that I forgot to uh, record locally, but it doesn't really matter, it's a typing game. I'll grab it off Twitch, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Alright, where are we going now? Oh boy, here we go. Meowth, that's nice. That's not the lining, you know it. Typing letters? Eight? Get out of here. You can do it. I ain't no bitch. Yeah. Fuck. Meowth. I did Meowka. Oh, mine show. There we go. A Pokemon I forgot about until Mustard reminded me of his existence. Mm hmm. What is this? Good question. Oh, that's the thing from Meowth's head, isn't it? Yeah. I guess it's for bonus stuff. Butterfree. Butterfree. Stop penalizing. I don't think it's penalizing me for uh, at typing more than I need to. Mm. It's if I type the wrong ones. Yeah. Mm. Pair lives another Pokemon that the Isle of Armor reminded me existed that I've forgotten about. There we go. Nice. Mine shall. Squirtle. Whimsor. I don't know. Mm. Wisma. <laughs> yep. That's a tough one. That always trips me up. Remember, it's the Pokemon with his butt all showing. I know. <laughs> so I can't keep a combo going, but I can type words. Results. New it's fine. That's what you need to really do. Maybe you should pick up the place yourself. I ain't here to be judged, I'm here to type. <laughs> to research the purple area where right ruins is, you need the title of Ace Typist. You can't go with your current title. You still need ten more medals. Jeez. How many you got so far? I can't see. Um, not entirely sure. But there's other places I could go. Thank you, Doug. Let's go to Y Habitat. Why not Habitat? Indeed. Get a combo of five. Alright. There we go. Sphiel. Combo three. Snow Runt. Snow Runt. Snow so guys in chat, which of Snow Runt's evolutions do you guys prefer? Glalie or Frozelass? Because I'm a Glalie man. Swine up. Swine up. Snow Runt. Snow Runt. Oh, Glaceon. Glaceon. Snow Runt. I'm seeing Glalie and the football <laughs> I wouldn't try kicking it, it's made of solid Sea ice. Yeah, we got a froze last as well. Nice. Yeah, I like Mega Glalie a lot. I use that in my Omega Ruby team. Mm -hmm. That was good, I like that one. Nicely done. Results. New ranking. That's the type of score I should be getting. Yeah. Nice. Good researching. Oh, I wonder if rare Pokemon turn up after you've done a bunch of combos. I think they're tied to the area, mm -hmm. as far as I recall. Number two, a Rainbow Railroad. Nice. Type quickly to research the Pokemon riding rail cars. They're fast. 
Aren't they all? They are when you're trying to type their names really quickly. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. Whimsy cut. I'm doing my best. You got another one? Come on. <laughs> it's coming. Oh, base star raptor. Yeah, it's pretty good. Next is Corv Knight. It's probably my favourite region of bird. There we go. Star raptor is particularly a broke as a close combat. Ah, uh, can't keep my combo worth a shirt. Boy, ah. Apparently, cannot go away. <laughs> I could not know, I've never actually used Lilligan like on a team. Is it actually good like is it actually a good cross top? Oh, boss time. Okay. We got Ho. -O. Yeah, here's the one. Oh, J. Seven. Three. Oh boy. That knocked me back a little bit. You're starting to see why I had trouble with him. Yep, I'm starting to see, mate. M J U. Fuck. Research over. God damn. Yeah, he's pretty. Results. Pretty on top of his game there. Good researching. Hmm. Let's retry that. Yeah. The boss theme in this game is way better than it has any right to be, but I'm totally down with that. Tengino. Am I to understand that uh, he's doing things in a diagonal pattern on the keyboard as well? Yeah, that's what I kind of noticed. But uh, the more I thought about that, the more it threw me off even more. Right. Apparently, the Lugan's a good sweeper. There we go. I don't think we have seen Septile Crow Battle Jolting just yet. We saw a Glaceon. You have to be legit fast to do these. Yeah. Oh boy. Here he comes. I'll try to do this, but there's no guarantees. Yeah, if he gives you too much trouble, you can always just go on to another one. Not doing a very good combo, but uh, I can do this. You, okay? you can't really combo ho with how quickly he's throwing this shit at you. <laughs> Don't give up. Bloody hell. 
Every time I think I get the diagonal working, it's not doing anything. Watch out. Bloody hell. Yeah. I'll give it one more try. Yeah, what right. I had it going for a second there, and then I wasn't like sure Where what it wanted of me. Hmm. So while you work your way back towards her there, I'm just going to remind everybody that we are raising money for the charity Child's Play. And what they do is they provide children in hospital with toys and games just to make their stay a little bit more manageable. Mm -hmm. Just, you know, take take the edge off being away from like, being from their family and their friends and whatnot. You know, it's a great cause and if you'd like to contribute to like the calls, then you can click donate just below the stream, or I can post this little link here in chat. You should go to the Tiltifier and it donates directly to the charity themselves, so you haven't got to worry about any middlemen or anything. Yeah. We've actually currently got uh, $4,401.96, which is above our like incentive target. But at this point, we just want to raise as much money as we can for the calls. So if you're able to chip in, it will greatly be appreciated. Why does a toga tick even need a minecart? Oh no. <laughs> I'm impressed you can so quickly remember what's a Minchino and what's a Chinchino. Oh boy, here we go. Again, there's no guarantee I'll be able to do this. No, that's alright. If it gives you too much trophy, like I say, you can always go on to one of the other levels. Yeah. God damn it! Yeah. It's hard to tell what's an actual diagonal on this. Results. Yeah. Alright, one more go. Okay. I think we should probably do that one. <laughs> At this point, Silver Dude's asking if you have to wait for four letters to show up. Because it seems like there's a delay between the flames and the letters. So, like, if you recognise where the diagonal's going, I wonder if you can just jump ahead of it. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. Oh, okay. <sighs> Molto bene. Oh, I remember you being kind of a pain in the ass in the, in the electric gym in black and white. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, it's just rubbing salt in the wind of the fact that that guy at the door explicitly tells you in that game to take in ground types. Like, fuck off, mate. Like. It does sound a little bit Tomodachi Life esque, yes. I never actually played that. I did see a lot of shit posts about it when it came out, though. Take it tomorrow. Was that the little spiky electric steel thing? Mm hmm. Yeah, I never was keen on that design. <sighs> right. God damn it. Don't give up.
Yeah, research over. Come on, one more try, Tom. You can do it. All right. New ranking. Good researching. This is just for myself here, but I'll force myself to stop after this bit. Yeah. Give it another shot, and however it goes, it goes. Two Venomoths. Oh, you're spoiling me now. Yeah. Yeah, Venny does some great Tomodachi Live videos. Alright. God, Mishana is hideous. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sort of fast, you know. Fast as fuck. Fast as fuck, boy! Does anyone actually like a peony? Like, out of all the baby Pokemon, it's like kind of a shit design, especially for Chansey. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, Justin does. Okay. You never stop. I think this whole game would be easier with the. Like a proper keyboard. What you is that? Oh, fuck off with that old pheasant shit. <laughs> yeah, he just came out of fucking nowhere. That must be a rare Pokemon then. Yeah. That right, calm Tom. Yeah, I can't tell what's meant to be a diagonal and what not. Mm. And it's gone. Because nah. ke keys don't go straight up. Nah. You should probably just try another one now, to be honest. Well, I maxed out my high school, so... Yeah. Pay attention to the fire, huh? You can type the letters once it turns red. Eh. Let's go to M. Yeah, see what we can get here. Nine letters now. I would gladly take nine letters over having to do diagonals and whatnot. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, that was a fast one. Fucking Tatuga. Like, I can at least give us some Pokemon we're likely to remember exists. Yeah. Yeah, I remember you enough, don't you worry. <laughs> Nobody can forget Tentacle no matter how much they want to. Green gold. Green gold again. <laughs> There's always gonna be another fucking green gold. Green gold again. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, my bloody combo. Horsey. Horsey again. Tentacle. Research complete. Yeah. Results. Great. Congratulations on researching what a tentacle is, I guess. Yeah, the thing is, I'm try if I focus on the letters, by the time I have them, the fucker will have, like, hurt me. Yeah, like, it does move really quickly, that hollow fight. Like, I'll give it a show. Whoa, she doesn't need the first letters of the name typed out for her anymore. Fucking criticising me for not being able to do it first. <laughs> oh, does this mean that she's going to ask you not to type the first letter, then? I'm not that sure. That sounds like... That sounds like it could be a right pain in the ass. Yeah. 
I'll activate the guide for your fingers. If you don't need it, turn it off at the control room. It's fine, we'll keep the finger guide. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's opening up more things, so that's good. Yeah. Seems like as long as we keep getting medals, we're going to keep making progress, so that's you, fine. You bitch, I will not be deterred. <laughs> uh. Honestly, Mushrani, you look like a fetus. I thought that was what he was kind of going for for a while, because it, like, it doesn't look like anything else. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, it might be a red herring, who knows. Yeah, maybe. Bloody hell. Alright, what we got? We got a Togetic. We got a Whimsy Cot. Not a Whimsy Scott. A Whimsy Cot. Whew, calm Tom. Calm in a calm blue ocean. Ka 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 combo. Sorry. Fuck off. I want the hot pheasant, damn it. <laughs> well, at least I've broken my combo. I mean, um, high score. <laughs> yeah, that's not the one that you want to break. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Don't give up. God damn it! It's the diagonal ones. Yeah. Results not bad. <sighs> Way to go. Just go on to another one, mate. Don't matter. All right, fine. I'm not stressed. I'm just annoyed that I can't do it. Yeah, I get ya. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Have some different stuff to look at. Yeah. It's all about raising money for the kids, after all. Yeah. Yeah, I have experience spelling you. Yeah, asshole. Oh, Trico, you're sneaky. <laughs> oh, he's just hiding out there, yeah, and he's got that stealth K and all the stealth C, depending on which one you tend to miss. Mm hmm. Uh, Tor. Terror. E. Cherim. N. Oh. Weedle. Fuck. Key. What the fuck is that? Durant. My favourite group is Durant Durant. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Yanma. A. Shrifty. There we go. Butterfree. Yeah, he hasn't... Shrifty hasn't got that eye that you think he has. Yep. Oh, my combo is awful though. Zig. Zag. Ooh. Ugh. Venusaur. Oh. Interesting. Oh, that's cool, like. Right? That must have been, like, what all the random letters that it throws at you are. Yeah. Well, I got a big score for catching him. Nice. That pushed me over the uh, silver medal threshold. Ah, cool. I'm kind of happy because I do actually have two pretty good condition copies of the Blaze Set Venusaur cards in my little box here. Alright. Which I'm not sure how much they're worth, but just the fact that they are Blaze Set cards in good condition makes me very happy. Mm hmm. 
Yeah, I've researched 108 different Pokemon. Get on my level. I literally have Bulbapedia right here. Don't I have, fuck yourself. <laughs> I'm literally riding Groudon like a bike. Look at it. <laughs> Alright, let's go to O. You can na now go to Q Castle. You researched a hundred different Pokemon. Bravo! Mm -hmm. Now you're ready to go... Spot... Okay. You're throwing a lot of things at me here. Don't worry, just keep on going through this. Eventually it will give you more Pokemon to type. Mm -hmm. That's all I want. Play Lee. Bear tick. Bear tick. Aww. Oh. Cool. Chew. chew. Fucking. <sighs> I don't like cup chew. Or the ice creams, for that matter. I love the uh, ice creams. Frostlass. <laughs> I feel like we've argued about the ice creams on several occasions now. <laughs> mm. There we go. And uh, no, Miley Mouse, I think you do have to use the specific DS keyboard. Like, I don't know if anyone's managed to mod any others to work with it, but it's such like a specific game that I doubt it. Snow Runt. Frostlass. Nil-ish. Research complete. Results, great! Meh. Bronze medal! Good researching! Should've got a better combo than that, but oh well. Yeah. Well, you still beat her, so what does it really matter? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, granted, I know most people's motivations aren't as petty as mine, but to me, usually if I do better than someone else, that's my satisfaction. Mm -hmm. What's free? Sparkling sunshine. Let's go have a look. The weather changes Solrock. when you research the soul rock that appears here. Interesting. Research soul rock. Why was Ho-Oh all the way at the beginning? That kind of annoys me. <laughs> I don't know. I guess there's going to be more legendaries later on. I wonder if the Soul Rock will use Cosmic Power when no one wants it to. Uh, yeah, I don't know much about Maracactus at all. Maracactus, yeah. It was like the Gen, Gen 5 XP at Cacnea. Mm -hmm. uh, cast Form. Trubbish. Infernate. Got it. That fucking pound size. Uh, Marowak. Sandile. Sandile's face. Nice. Saw rock again. Hey, Kurunai, I try not to remember the existence of Bergmite and Avalog. Oh. Fuck off, Lee Fanny. No one likes Lee Fanny. Uh, got enough score, I guess. Research complete. Results. New ranking. Um, yeah, not bad. Medal. <laughs> medal. Yeah. Good researching. We doing it. So rare Pokemon turn up when your combo gets bigger, I guess. Yeah, seems so. All right, to the dark path of L. Or Lunatone. One yeah. of the two. One of the two. Rare abilities here. Ooh, nice. Don't know if that means anything. Research Pokemon that appears at the end of the course. Okay. I assume that is the Lunatone. Possibly, yeah. The yeah, Grass and Bug does just seem like doomed to fail as a type combo to start with, because that's like weak to fucking everything. Mm -hmm. Oh no, they give you Lunatone right away. 
Dusk Noir. Dusk Noir. Dusk Lops is cooler. Whatever. <laughs> Look at Al. Nice. Fairy. Fairy. Combo three. I remember a Murkrow uh, on a stream once. Oh my god, is Zorak. Oh, nice. Alright, let's go. What you got for me? Don't give up. Okay, so he turns into things I have to spell. That makes okay, sense. Okay, that's cool. Uh. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Gotcha. Very done. Too many typos okay. and that for my liking, but I got a medal, so. Yeah. Fuck you, got mine. Results, new ranking. Bronze medal. Yeah, I like X and Y as well. Uh, that's probably my least favourite gen at this point. Yeah, I'd, like, it's my favourite, like, tied with two. I'm not sure what I would say is my least favourite. I feel like before I can properly rank them, I need to spend a bit more time with the main Gen 5 games, just mm. to kind of get a more informed opinion on that. Because, like, I know I hear a lot of good things about Black and White 2, but like, that's the part that I haven't played for myself, so... Right. Got dazzle typing. Shasha. You just pull out a keyboard and start glowing. <laughs> His power is so awesome. Where are we going next? Oh. 100 Fey. Huzzah. Number 4 train ride. Alright, if you insist. I can see what people mean when they say that Kalos was a bit dull, but... To me, I, I, like, I'm just bought in by the whole like French theming. I think that's really cool. Mm -hmm. Oh, I saw Shaman. Oh, what is his name? B Sharp. Thank you. Yeah, I remember you, Son Flora. <laughs> as much as we try not to. Shroomish. Dollar, are you fucking mad? <laughs> Who's that yellow guy? I don't recognise him. The lava, my boy. Oh yeah. You can fuck off with that name. <laughs> Trico. Burr. Why are you so hard to spell? Yeah, I could do let a lot go with Kalos because it was like the first 3D Pokemon game, so I feel like that may be something that I do look past. But mm -hmm. you know, I like I think Lumios in particular when you like walk around and like yeah the camera's a bit shit, but just the feel of the game it feels very Parisian and I like that. Okay. That's fair mate. Yeah. Doesn't pull it off quite like, say, Riven Faith does, but you know. Alright, I guess we can uh, change our uh, skin again now. Okay, what type did we unlock? I looked away. Uh, Watermelon. Okay. That's not as cool. Ah, <sighs> not particularly, no. Alright, we're going to Semicolon Junction over here. That's certainly a name. Unknown, ah, okay. Okay, alright. Research free Pokemon. Oh, no. oh I see. Nice. Oh, so you do have to work out what type, what letter it is, let's go. Cool. Nope, it's a U, you dumb fuck. Nope. 
Uh, that's an R. That's a Y. That's an I. Clearly in H. Clearly. <laughs> Another H. Uh, v. Okay, sure. Uh, can you give me some bit? Nope, that's a V. The uh, H1's kind of bullshit because when it's side on from the wall, it sort of looks like an O. Yeah. Good enough. Results new ranking. Bronze medal. Well, I got bronze and silver, so that's good enough for me. Yeah, it works. <laughs> oh, I think there's a legendary coming up here. Yeah, I'll go. Apparently there's a couple of new legendaries coming in uh, the Crown Tundra. What, look, we haven't seen yet? Mm-hmm. Oh, that could be cool. Like, I hope they are ones for, like, big dungeons that you get to explore. Because it looks like the Crown Tundra is leaning a bit more that way. Well, it's more about exploration. Yeah, like, that, that's what I kind of missed from Sword and Shield. Because, like, it's cool when you have the plot-specific legendaries. Like, we've got the... Sassian and Zamazenta and Eternatus and whatnot, but there's also a degree of fun from just finding a cave somewhere and just exploring that. I don't know where you are. Chair Ruby. Okay. Ori gone too. Yeah, Silver Dude, the, that's kind of one that I'm a bit mixed on, like the EXP share from X and Y, because I like it, it's a convenience thing, but the problem is that you have with it being optional is that you can't really balance the game for people who would have it on and off at the same time. So what you find is that if you have it on, for convenience, then you just go along and fight all the trainers you see. Yeah. You're going to be like ridiculously over level by the time you get to your League 4. Clever. Clever. Oregon 2. Oregon 2. The best Paragon. I can't type worth a shit, but I got more than it wanted to. Yeah, I know I'd made a lot of mistakes. Give me all this. It's fine, that Porygon 2 has all correct. <laughs> Better A medal than no medal. Can I not go to that forward slash thing yet? You can't go to Sunset. Okay. Fair enough. Bracket Lake. Research 7 Pokemon. It is a tiny ass thing, yeah, but that's not really, yeah. Uh, Pan pan yeah, it's not really an excuse. Nah, it's just it's just like adapting to the fact that it's smaller, really. There we go. I'll show what. Oh, that was a fast one. Okay, what's the name of that thing that Timpo evolves into? I think it's like Seismitoad or Palpitoad or something. I forget which one is the final one and whatnot, but I remember Ash had one of them that only got used in like five episodes or some shit. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oh, Weasel. Fuck. Thank you for having an easy to spell name. Magikarp. Oh yeah. Booyah. People sort of like a Mac keyboard. I would say it's probably actually more ergonomic than a Mac keyboard because at least the keys have a slight little dip in them to make them easier to press. Mm -hmm. Mac one, like everything, is just flat. Yeah, I don't really want to like make um, excuses for my typing and whatnot. I just make mistakes sometimes. It happens. Apostrophe power station. Interesting. Mm. Oh, that's a Pachirisu in silhouette. That took me a minute. Mm -hmm. 
There was Electabuzz's evolution in there as well. No, Electivire. It's okay. It, oh. Like, I, I like Electivire's design, but apparently it's not that great in, like, actual battles. I'm typing the dork. No, nah, in the dork, no less. What the hell is that? Shroomish. No, that's a Joltik. <laughs> Lux Ray. Oh, you can turn the light on. Interesting. That's cool. Magnazone. Nope, that's a slash. Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought I typed it. Oh, believe me, dude, I was using a Mac as my main computer for a good few years. I I fully understand the pain of a Mac keyboard. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, what's this? There it is, you motherfucker. Yeah, I really like to fire. Got him. Combo five. Nice. Results. New ranking. Bronze medal. Good researching. Magnus own baby. Am I allowed to go there now? Yes, I am. Good. Sunset Forge slash Way. Did you go after strong Pokemon and get your ass kicked? <laughs> hey, I'd say my favourite Gen 4 electric Pokemon is probably Luxray. It's all about Magnazone for me. Well, Magnazone is cool, but, like, you know, Luxray is easy to get early on, and he's a big cat lion thing, mm -hmm. so you know. Sorry, I wasn't straight for that. <sighs> no, right. that's fine. Uh, there we go. Let's all. So, Losis. Yeah, I know Luxray's stats apparently aren't that great, but he did the job for me in Platinum. Fluffy Line's cool as well, like, and Frost has worked for us in Colosseum. Uh... Chim Cha So low sis. What the hell are you? Holy shit, that was fast. Oh, Scrafty, yeah, he's just in and out. There we go. Oh. Cobalion. Oh, yeah. The only one that I actually really like from that little line up with Legendaries. Hmm. I love this one because it doesn't instantly attack me. <laughs> That's a benefit as well. There we go. The yeah, Kabalian GX is actually part of my main deck right now in the TCG. Because it has an ability that prevents your steel type Pokemon from being affected by uh, status effects. Neat. So you just sort of put it on the bench and forget about it, and you just sort of immune to uh, paralysis and poison and whatnot. And given there's a few poison decks that are running right in the current meta, it does come in handy. Mm -hmm. I really hope I don't have to beat Howo to beat the game. Well, we'll see. <laughs> Reshiram and Zekrom can't be far ahead. Let's go. Okay, that's a bit of a leap, Professor. I was doing, like, Blitzels a bit ago. <laughs> Mount Battle for Hoa. Yeah, we know all about that, don't we, Flo? Yeah. 
And there was a reason I didn't include that in the playthrough. Yep. I remember Chugger did in his, and he sped the whole thing up just to show off how long it took, and god damn, why ain't doing that shit? Bloody hell. <laughs> We go back to typing and leave the uh, midlife crisis back in uh, sunset forward slash whatever. <laughs> it doesn't work like that. That's not how life goes down. I'm sorry. Mm. Right, where are we going now? Oh, cool. Fin. Number five, Golden Road. Okay. Sounds cool. I'm sure a lot of these are optional. Yeah, but we get more Pokemon to collect, so it's fine. Mm -hmm. Can you gather five gems? I'll do my best. <laughs> we can try. We won't know until we try it. There we go. Skitty. Balls. The thing for this one, from what I can tell, is a bunch of cats and Simipool. Yeah, basically. Um, Sableye. Yeah. Combo three. Give me them precious gems, baby. Shout out to the Sableye V card from Rebel Clash, which is aesthetic as fuck. All right, there we go. Lipard. Get the fuck out of here. Perlon. Yes, I remember him from that one episode. Yep. It's enough. How is this a common road? Just seems like any suburban road near the crazy cat lady's house, basically. <laughs> Alrighty. Fun. Oh shit. There are three legendary Pokemon here in Function Tower. Oh wait, no. Oh, good. <laughs> I'm seeing other things on the thing here. Oh, okay. You need the Ace Typist title. Let's check your title. Wow, you're amazing. You have the title. Come on, let's go. Several Pokemon will appear at once here, so start typing their names from the left Pokemon. You got it. Aim for a thousand points. Oh. Azura. Yeah, see, experiment, that won't work because these, like the DS keyboard, doesn't actually have F keys on it. Wasn't sure what it wanted me to do, though. Oh, you have to input a space. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's where I was going wrong. Yeah, so just do both of the Pokemon like as one thing. Got it. There we go. Execute is a hard one to spell if you can't recall how to do it properly. Yeah, it's a bit of a clusterfuck. There we go. Oh, it wasn't ready for me, yeah. Bloody hell, restart though. It seemed like they were just jumping between each other just to throw you off as to what order they'll be in. Mm -hmm. God damn it. Really? Fucking far fetched with his <laughs> stupid apostrophe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you good? Imagine if there was a Welsh Gaelic version of the game. God damn. <laughs> Jesus. There we go. Mario. 
There we go. Get out of here, Farfetch. <laughs> you got him. You're not even the cool Farfetch. There we go. Zero again. Accompanied by a Charizard. Just bros hanging out. Yeah. Oh, that was close. Well, my combos were shot, but I did it. Yeah. Well, you take the pictures you can get. Yeah. I know I made a lot of mistakes. Why do you have to say that every time? <laughs> Just gotta rub it in. Good researching. Fuck off. Be good researching. <laughs> Alright. Alt Girl. You can't go to Paradise Above just yet. You need to be able to get at least 5,000 points at left X expats. Okay. Let's do it here. Left expats. Oh, there's some tough ones here. Aim for 5,000 points. Whew. So we're in a fucking void of nothing. Okay. Mm -hmm. I gotta keep my combos up here. Yeah. Gratarita. Uh, Woobat. Woobat. Combo three. What a stupid Pokemon. Yeah, that's fine. Combo five. It's Gratulita. fine, but it's stupid. Zaxi. You're just mean. Really? I know. It's not my fault that he's Gratulita. just a shitty version of Zubat. Uh, play doll. BH. Play doll. Woo. Mr. Dot Mime. Oh, Rita. Yeah, we have a super at home. <laughs> uh, routes. Routes. Cool. Ah. Oh. I didn't get the secret Pokemon, that's a shame. Yeah. Well, I think you can figure out who it is. Oh. His anime cry is the funniest shit I have ever heard. Here it is. <laughs> yeah. <Anime cry>. <laughs> <laughs> I was worried if you actually saw the it just to say. <laughs> yeah, I've never used the Gothita line. It's crazy, 12 Eric. Hmm. Alright. Ah. <sighs> Paradise Above. Oh boy. I've never seen this far before. The Pokemon here must be very strong. I'm assuming this is black and white. Reshiram and Zekrab might be the last ones. Maybe, yeah. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Paradise Above sounds like the afterlife. I think that's what they're going for. Uh, so are these Pokemon are dead? Get yourself a motherfucking Dragonite. That's right, a Dragonite. The OG, the OG. Yeah, oh, yeah. The best fucking video. <laughs> uh, there we go. What's your typos, Tom? Stay on target. There we go. Oh boy. Here comes uh, one of the America's greatest internet providers ever, Verizon. <laughs> You're gonna type out it as that, I bet. N B C B X. FG, he's joking. Oh, it's nice when it's like horizontal. <laughs> I bet, yeah. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Why are you sending at me over here? 
Probably the same voice. Verizian. Got him. And it gives you the proper uh, pronunciation as well. Oh, well done. Results. New ranking. God, you got a lot of points for that. Well, it's a legendary Pokemon. Ah, I'm now the admirable typist. Can you the new skin? Yep. Where's the last one then? Hmm. I guess we'll find it. Yeah, I Somewhere. Guess, I guess we will. There we go. Yeah, it looks alright. <sighs> so this is Dark Depths. Don't worry, the submarine has arrived. What the fuck is Reshiram doing in an underwater place? I hope he's at least got like a little cave under there or something. Yeah, research nine Pokemon. Okay. Oh, what the fuck are you? A jellison? Uh... That throws me off, because that's not a fish. Uh, hello... Hello... Oh, fuck, hello... Hello, the Momo, or whatever the fuck it is. God, for me, that's just the same thing. The king has returned. Hi, hi, mister. Yeah, I kind of have to slow down a bit there. Um, Relicamp. Chincha. There we go. So it's a low mamola. I guess so. <laughs> Even that took a run up. Yeah, my combo wasn't very good there. Oh well. Nah, well. Wasn't that meant to be a, a powerful Pokemon here? Yeah. Unless that's just one of the others. Trodagon. Okay, Russia Evans Ekron got to be here. It may have been pointing to the right, I wasn't able to tell. I don't know, it did look like it was coming off of the bottom key there, but I guess not. It's, it's moved now, I think. Mm -hmm. Good luck, you're gonna need it. Re research Zekrom or Reshiram. Oh, okay. Interesting. So I wonder if there's like, a, like an extra level with Kurum somewhere. Maybe. Oh, what the fuck are you? I can never remember you. S something really hard to type, no doubt. Yeah, it's I always confuse it with Coffee Grievous because they've got a similar kind of color scheme. Mm -hmm. That's a hard one. They're probably all going to be hard ones now. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. That for you. Like that Pokemon. Man. It's Magnezo, not Magnezo. Just remember that. Yeah. Oh, bloody hell. Salamence. Nearly. Mm. He ran away. Nearly. Oh. Let's redo that. Ideals or truth? Ideally, both. Sigilith makes me think of a uh, Siglemic. I don't know what that is. It's a streamer, mate. Oh, right. And I am so out of touch with stuff nowadays. <laughs> yes, you are. Uh, if, if it's not spoon fed to me on Twitter, I don't know what's going on. Well, you could take a look around you, mate. Bloody hell. While I'm here giving all this to you, I can't bloody type. <laughs> I'm not a fucking boom, I just think. Come on. <laughs> Cavalier. 
Oh go look, he's so cool. It really is. Like, I like what they do with him in the TCG, they give him like really overly dramatic attack names. Let me see if I can find some examples. Look. Like, this fist of antiquity. You've got dig out there. Go lurk hammer. Iron fist of justice. Ghost hammer. There we go. Uh, lots of points for a dragon. Oh my god. It's a Garchomp. Oh, you've lost. <laughs> Oh wait, it's not Gen 4, you're fine. Yep, we're all gone, mate. Haxorus. I can't stop typoing. Oh. I think that's one of the things that makes Platinum easier than Diamond Poe, the fact that you can get a Garchomp much earlier. Darkstone. Let's go, Biatch. Oh boy. So the sappy boy. More, you say? Oh boy. Don't give up. What the fuck is he doing? He's spinning stuff around. See, that's slower. However, it comes at you like a bolt of lightning. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Is Hollow Light a super boss that they just give you really early for some reason? I honestly don't know, mate. <laughs> like, it would make sense given how this guy seems a lot more manageable. Yeah. Watch out. Oh boy. I don't know what it's wanting in here. Oh, bloody hell. Just a line at the bottom, I think. It's Disco Night in Spice. <laughs> Gosh, yeah. Nice. You reached your target. Oh, I must be dreaming. Did we really fucking spell that guy's name and catch him with a single Pokeball? <laughs> nah. Professor, that actually happened. Oh my god, amazing. You've done quite a bit of research. Let's have a look at you. Not bad. See, you've missed quite a few Pokemon too. Well, that's because there's a lot of optional stages. <laughs> there sure is. I think I'm going to leave here a worse typist than when I started. <laughs> <laughs> like, now he's trained you on the little people. Going back to the normal one is going to feel weird. Oh, yeah. Oh, I think we might have started. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. What are you wanting at me? This is credits. I guess try typing in Dragonite. No, it just goes dun, dun, dun. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> I guess you beat the game. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually glad this has a different ending to the last typing game we played. Yeah. Yeah, it's not letting me type or anything, it's just, I guess, taunting me. <laughs> yeah, it's like, you see this Porygon Z here? Too bad. Nope. <laughs> so, Flame, what was your opinion of a uh, Pokemon typing adventure? It seems genuinely cool. Yeah, like, stuff like the Ho-Oh seems a little bit bullshit, but I take it, like, he's optional, so whatever, but, you know, it's cool. Like, I, I wish you could get a bigger keyboard for it, but I realise that he's aimed at kids, so, mm -hmm. you know, it did what it needs to do. 
I guess we'll just stay here and watch Do all these Pokemon come out as. Have you enjoyed your time typing all these Pokemon's name in? Um, it wasn't actually half bad, it was fun. Um, I'm so terrible at keeping my clumb up though, I do apologise for that. It's fine, like, you're doing alright. <laughs> yeah, I suppose I was. I got medals on most of them, so... Yeah, well that's, that's all you need to progress. Yeah, I ranked at least. It is surprisingly long, yeah. Is, yeah, especially given that there is a lot of optional stuff as well as the ones that you have to do. Mm-hmm. Look at him dancing there. But yeah, you enjoy the credits. <laughs> you did it. I don't think we ever saw this level. I vaguely recognise it, but I don't remember Combi showing up, so maybe not. No. Yeah. I guess to be fair, when you've just got a park area scrolling at you, there's only so much you can do to make them distinct. Mm -hmm. Pretty sure there's a post game and whatnot. Well, there's, there's going to be all the levels that you haven't played yet, aren't there? No, oh, of course, yeah. Plus also that final level, I would assume you can go back there and get a uh, rush around. Maybe, maybe. Look at that Charmander there. Best star. Yeah, best star. So guys, what's your been? What be 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 where I can't talk and I can't type, apparently. Jesus Christ. How have you enjoyed uh, day five of the HFC Super Nintendo Fun? Basically, the Pokemon block. Stadium 2 Showcase, Pokemon Dash, Pokemon Tournament DX Story Mode Playthrough, and a bit of Pokemon Typing Adventure. Yes, that's right. Boost my ego. Mm. <laughs> that work that only works if you get positive feedback, you know, you're gambling a bit there. Mm -hmm. I'm not doing DDR Mario. <laughs> that would be amazing. Actually, Tom, you can stream GameCube games now. I could. And you have a camera. I'm not no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. I think if I exercise now, I might die. <laughs> uh, well, I've got to do Wii Sports later in the marathon. <laughs> so if I die on stream, it, you're a suspect. Well, hmm. <laughs> I'm, I'm weighing the cost of losing you versus the benefits of losing you. Uh, well, you get a slight boost in PR, but you have to do more work yourself. So Yeah, fuck that. <laughs> you gotta find someone else first. I'm typing F. And I don't I don't care if that's not correct. Oh, staff credits. I was supposed to be typing the staff credits. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright. Beautiful. That's the perfect end to that. Basically, yeah. <laughs> I wanna try one more stab at ho -Oh, and then we'll wrap things up here. Yeah, go for it. Save two, it's got a little star on it. Yeah, mate. Hello, welcome back. Thanks to you, I've discovered more places. If you don't mind, could you do some research? I really need it. <laughs> Please do my job for me. I know I'm the professor, but you're the random kid. Yeah. I don't think I unlocked a single sound in there. No. So guys, while we get one more round of Hollow in, do you want to see if you can get any last minute donations in for today? Hmm, that would be nice. We're currently at $4,401.96, but if we can get it a bit higher tonight, that'd be nice. Jesus. Are you done unlocking? Thank you. You can view the credits from the control room. I'm good, thanks. You're not going to type in all those names this time around. I'm good, mate. <laughs> oh. Let's see what we got going on tomorrow. Tomorrow, uh, Spa's going to be starting off with Star Fox Assault. I think mm -hmm. that's the GameCube one, isn't it? Uh, yes, it is, mate. Okay, then after that, we've got Tetris 99, which Snake's going to be playing, and I'm going to be in the call for. Hannah's playing ARMS. You're on playing WarioWare. 
we'll go with gold for that is, the 3DS mm -hmm. one. Yep. And then we're wrapping up with Yoshi's Safari, that's Snake again. Nice. So, yeah, this is our first variety day going on, so we get a little bit of everything. Yeah, wasn't the first GameCube Star Fox game the main one? Uh, yes it was. Uh, oh yeah, I remember Stephen ran that during the last Nintendo one, yeah. Yeah, um, Star Fox Temperatures, or whatever it was called. <laughs> Star Fox Adventures, yeah, that's the gun one. <laughs> one. Balls. That's fight people, it looks cool. It's nice, yeah. To be fair guys, I do see a few people saying they like Star Fox Adventures. Isn't the main problem people have with it that it's just not really a Star Fox game? Basically. Which I suppose fair enough. Oh boy. <coughs> Here we go. <sighs> Balls, I was like... Okay. Yeah, I tried. That's too hard for me. Yeah. Fair enough, mate. Well, this brings us to an end of a uh, Pokemon typing adventure. At least I uh, ranked on the leaderboard there, I suppose. But hey, some things are just a wee bit too tricky for me. Rocky Mountains is there. What else we got? We got that. We got that. Just see what else is uh, brought along. Yeah. Interesting. Caps Lock Museum. Ha! Uh -huh. <laughs> Left Shift Challenge. Oh, they I really see. need to reach for some of these names, I can see. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, so, yeah, we are going to leave things here. Thank you all so much for attending day five of the HFC Super Nintendo Fun. We'll see you tomorrow, bright and early, for the start of day six, Variety Day. Bye for now.